Military Occupational Specialty Unmanned Aerial Vehicle Operator. These soldiers pilot and operate the Army's Unmanned Aerial Vehicles, or UAVs, which gather imagery and sensory data for intelligence analysis. Libby, Striker 1-4, request recovery on runway 06. Because intelligence information is sensitive, you must qualify for a secret security clearance in this MOS. Then the Army will train you first in the theories of flight and basic flight procedures, then to assist in the deployment and recovery of the UAVs. You'll also train to remove the system from its transport mode and prepare it for launch status, training that will include installing and removing the aircraft's payload, assembling, adjusting, and operating the ground control station and navigational systems, as well as to assemble the basic control support systems. The Army will also train you to remotely launch and recover the UAV and inspect and repair minor tears in the vehicle's skin. After your initial entry training and advanced individual training, you'll work long hours in the field, day or night, where you may be a flight line operator responsible for assembling the aircraft, preparing antennas, generators, and communications cables. You may also work as an air vehicle operator responsible for its pre-flight, launch, and operation. In addition, you may be a mission payload operator responsible for the imagery collection assets on board. Serving in this MOS can help you transition from the military to the civilian employment sector because your skills in leadership, teamwork, and problem solving, combined with a more developed sense of responsibility, self-discipline, and motivation, are skills and values in demand by civilian employers. By providing a clear picture of enemy hostile intent or actions, you are a vital asset as a military occupational specialty unmanned aerial vehicle operator.